that is so fetch. Hey y'all, welcome back to the channel. If you are new here, welcome. My name is Kaya and today we are going to be listening to the brand new single by new metal band Tala. Now they just released a brand new single on the 1st of September 2022 and it is called Shaken Not Stirred. Um, and I actually was personally reached out by, um, reached out? Yeah. <laughs> Tala actually personally requested me to react to this band and uh, they're also signed with Earache who we are partnered with so this is a really exciting video and I'm so honored and excited to uh, check out this band's new song. I've heard I've heard the name Tala around on YouTube and I've actually seen because I have like some like weird face for the thumbnail and I've been seeing that kind of float around so I'm very interested. They're from Pennsylvania and um, I haven't really checked out anything from Pennsylvania yet. So very excited. Um, thank you so much to Tala for um, requesting me to listen to this and um, yeah I'm very excited. So. And without further ado, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, please feel free to do so. We are growing in numbers, y'all. So the, the community is growing. Join the metal journey. We have so much planned. Join our Discord, the Mosh Pit, down below. There's an invite link in the description. Um, also, you can send me stuff through the P.O. Box if you want something to be featured in a metal unboxing video. Y'all know the deal, so let's get into Shaken Not Stirred by Tala. she like a bass player or is she your guitarist oh she's cute um first impressions I, I really love the instrumentation so far it's giving me like slipknot vibes like older slipknot vibes um because y'all told me in that reaction that they banged the beer kegs and you know they have the two i think they have two percussionists so that's kind of what's like reminding me of it also yeah, the vocals too is kind of giving me like Corey Taylor vibes. That's the lead singer for Corn, not Corn, slip that, right? I'm learning, I'm learning. <laughs> to that part because everything cuts out and then you have the like just the drum hit I was preparing for like a breakdown but you kept it going you kept it going also really loved that everything kind of like stopped panned this way drum hit I think that was the, the format and then you expect a, you expect a breakdown don't get it so you get slapped in the face mmm there's, there's a lot that's happening, a lot that's moving, but I really, really like it, and the drums are recorded really, really nice. Oh, 
That bridge. Ooh, that's gonna sound nasty live. Cause it's very catchy. The chorus is definitely something I could see myself singing along to. But the ooze, the way that you've paired it. Cause you start with just one simple ooh. And at first I was like, oh, I hope they do a little bit more harmonies. Cause I could see myself belting out those oohs in a, in a show. Best day just being like, ooh. Mm -mm -mm. And then you got those other harmonies. So it's just like the most beautiful, like clean, Mm, it's like eating something spicy and then you just like, mmm, it's like smooth like butter, like ice cream or something. I don't know. That was really, really nice. I feel like this is just going to be, ooh, with the right lighting too. Get the blue lighting while you're on stage. Mmm. I could see it. I could see it. <laughs> multiple members is she rhythm more like rhythm or is she like lead how do you achieve that scream because we just did a reaction on I'm shortening the name Zavleg which I'll link here the band with a really long name and they had screams that were similar to what you just achieved in here and uh that's like a blood curling scream. I would literally ruin my voice if I didn't place that right. Oh my god. Wow. Alright. Alright. Give me the rest of this clip. body are you kidding me that was like set up like a horror movie I feel like I just saw like the evil villain of a horror movie and then that was it and I was just like that it ended oh <laughs> I feel like very <laughs> disturbed and like edge of the seat <laughs> but I really enjoyed the song but it was just like oh my gosh okay the ending Let's talk about this, okay? Because that is going to slap 
live. You did like two different kinds of like breakdown endings. The first one was like, okay, yeah, we're, you know, breaking down the song. And it was kind of like this funky, like, tempo. But, ooh, and then you, like, play around with it. It's like, oh, we're going to end. No, never mind. We're going to even do, like, a slower, like, grimier sort of <laughs> I, just breakdown. Oh, and then you make it so scary. You could play around with that, too. Because you could... I, I, could, I noticed that there was, like, a little um, vocal, like, kind of interlude dissection, something like that. Like, it'd be so cool if you did, like, some sort of horror thing, like, horror ending, things go, like, sort of black, or, like, you just see the shadows, and it's dissection, and then, like, I don't know, you could have some, like, creepy surgeon, like, I don't know, or some, like, old, weird movie in the back screen, or something like that, and then, like, it opens up to something else. Um, oh, man, because y'all are about to go on tour or you are on tour I know that there's shows yep it says here on the video which I will link their their music video down in the description so you can see their dates um but yeah y'all are oh you're going to Austin you're coming to South Carolina why'd you skip North Carolina oh never mind you're coming to Jacksonville oh I might have to come and see that so y'all are going on tour on the 25th. Oh, that's so exciting. Headline show. Super cool. All right. I mean, I'm down. What do these people have to say? Are we still recording? Yeah, okay. I feel like a little teenager on the early 2000s listening to a new Slipknot mix, Slipknot single on MTV. Yeah. It, the beginning sounded like Slipknot, but y'all amped it up definitely more. At least from, like, what I've heard from Slipknot, which hasn't been too much, y'all definitely amped it up a lot. I'm so glad there's a whole scenario on the metal today that can bring me this feeling I could never get before. But especially you guys. Everything y'all put out is pure gold. Effing wow. Definition of taking a risk with a song. It's an absolute beauty. People talk about wanting a fresh sound in metal and it feels like there are hundreds of flashing signs on the highway yelling at you. Pre-order that album. Oh, it's been a while since I've heard a heavy song that just makes me laugh because of how heavy and ridiculous it is, especially at the ending breakdown. Yeah, definitely that ending breakdown is nasty. It's definitely new metal, which is not something we've really featured too much on the channel, but it's, and as somebody that's like brand new to listening to metal, it's like, yes, there's kind of the formula of like a commercial sound. Although this is like a five minute song. So, you know, typically if we're going super formulaic with commercial music, it's like three minutes, 3.30. So this is definitely longer. Really co catchy chorus. Nice break, or uh, Yes, nice breakdown, but also a very nice bridge. Um, very pleasant to listen to, but y'all amplified it. Y'all definitely amplified it. And it's something you can sing to, but gives you, like, the intensity that you want, is what I feel like. Not only the best song from the album so far, but easily the best song from the discography for now, for me. Wow, that's a cool compliment. Super excited for the new album. Can't wait to see how the story will unfold. I'm glad that I discovered you. In the immortal words of the late Dennis Green, go ahead and crown their ass. Oh my gosh. I'm also just really, really impressed with your vocalist. Um, I wish that I had a name on here. Hold on. Hold on. I'm going to do it. Members. So who do we have? Hungry, drum kit, lead guitar. So is Hungry still in it? Hungry Lights? Um, yeah, the vocals. Definitely that was intense. 
your vocalist is insane. And the, like, ending deep guttural sound, you held that out for a long time. A long time. So very tasty. Let's see what these lyrics say. We got more McDonald's ads, guys, just so you know. So I hope, you know, you're fine with more McDonald's ads from these people. <laughs> Shaken, not stirred, Tala. Ooh, what's this album cover? That's a cool drawing. No, I don't care about your at Frickin' get out of my face. Genius, we have to talk. All right. Bat wings. Weird, like, oh, it's like a cool skull. Interesting. So this new album, The Generation of Danger. Oh, you bow to no one. I wouldn't say that. I'd only just made myself so comfortable. It seems my plan was full of holes. I dared to walk the blurring line. I dared to think, oh, it's all so romantic. Get dunked into the bowl. I couldn't reach into your soul. Misfortune rang, but I couldn't effing get it. I couldn't pick up the phone, man. I'm stupefied. I still don't effing get it. It's got me so surprised. When I pull it all apart, it gets hard to keep on believing you. What is this song about? I dared to say I walked the blurring line, your scales, they matched the sky, but they won't be there tomorrow and I won't want to see mistakes, so you'll go down alone. I won't find no relief, I'll just have regrets that you couldn't be changed. Ooh. It, I took the passport to nowhere. So it is an unreviewed thing. Not all Dicker's experiments were successes. Sometimes impatience can be your downfall. What can you learn from your past mistakes? So are we talking about trying to change someone or? I don't know. I would like, to, I'd be curious to know. Obviously it's a new song, so we're still kind of figuring out like what it means. <laughs> But, um, I'm really excited. I really liked what y'all put out, so I'm definitely down and interested to check out this Generation of Danger record. 13 tracks. So you released The Impressionist, Shake It Not Stirred, and Telescope. All right. Let's see some more info from here. Pennsylvania. They're influenced by bands such as Corn, Code Orange, and Slipknot. Yeah, definitely heard the, the Slipknot. A little bit of Corn. The band consists of Max Portney, son of infamous Max Portney, and Justin Bonitz, a renowned YouTube musician. Why do I know this? Justin Bonitz. Why do I know that name? Why does that sound so familiar? I mean, I know I'm a YouTuber also, but like, that sounds really familiar. Hungry Lights. Oh. This is cool. I've heard the name. I've heard Justin Bonitz before, but I haven't seen any of your videos yet. I'm going to have to check it out. Okay, cool. Great. I just wanted to see like some more info. So that is going to do it for our video on Tala. Thank you so much to Tala for uh, recommending me the song to listen to. And um, I'm really excited about um, their newest record. If you are interested in finding out more information, um, I'm going to link all of their social media, this music video, and the link to where you can pre-order their album down below. Also check their touring dates. Bestie, they're going on tour September 25th and they're hitting a lot of states, so make sure you go and check that out, see if they're coming to a city near you. Um, and yeah, I'm really, really excited. Thank you so much for watching this video today. Thanks so much for spending time with me as always. 
please subscribe if you want to join our discord and um yeah i'll see you very very soon okay very soon i love you bye guys